Brother and sister, the celestial energy. What's going on, brother? Wisdom. Hope you understood that last message about the solar neutrinos. How our galactic sun is sending neutrinos, these powerful radioactive particles, to our planet, to our realm, throughout the entire galaxy. All right? Because our galactic sun is the head of the galaxy. All right? The galactic sun. Now, we have a galactic moon as well, but, you know, that the galactic moon con controls the uh, magnetic fields. All right? Um, helps to keep magnetic fields stabilized, polarized, all that good stuff. All right? Um, it's a huge moon. All right? And, you know, of course, these Saxons already studied our galaxy. Uh, I mean, a small part of our galaxy. Our galaxy is very big. And we have star systems all throughout the galaxy. And what we're looking at is we're looking at the shifting energies that are getting ready to take place at this present moment in time. All right. We're looking at extremely powerful shifting energies that are getting ready to take place. Um, the key in this is understanding that our um, that our galactic sun is soon to go supernova. And this is why these Saxons are watching the sun. You know, you know, they gotta put a time on everything. They gotta say, oh, this this works this time right here, and this happens these many times, and these many years this happens here, and these many years that's that happens there. And it's not so, you know. They 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 they're trying to put a um a marker on the energy that's that's coming around. You know, they really don't under, understand anything. I mean, I'm telling you right now, brothers and sisters, these beings, these Saxon beings do not understand the entire the entirety of anything. All right. Everything that they they know of is theory. All right. So we know that Nibiru is in the presence of our galaxy. And we know that Nibiru and other planets like Nibiru, which are highly magnetic planets. Now you understand when you change the magnetic field in, 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 a, in a vast area, something like, like a galaxy, you're gonna be looking at a lot of freaking changes, all right? And they are saying, oh, we, we've never seen the sun do this here. We've never seen the sun in all the years we've been watching the sun. We've never seen this happen here. We've never seen this happen here. You know, you got to understand that there are cosmic organisms called planets that are playing an extremely powerful role in the evolution of galaxies of universes all right so what's the importance of nibiru nibiru is here for evolution nibiru is here to help us go supernova all right now you have to understand understand overstand brothers this, this is not the first time our sun has ever gone supernova our sun has been going supernova many times all right Many times have our sun gone supernova. Many times have our sun literally uh, gone into the higher status. I mean, because our sun is now in that at that point. So, like we said in the last in the last message, our sun is sending these powerful neutrinos throughout the entire galaxy. Why? So the entire galaxy can go supernova. It's just that nothing just. A planet doesn't go supernova on its own without the galaxy, without the other planets. All the planets at the same time go supernova. All right? Now, does this happen in all universes? No. It's, 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 it's according to the energies in the universes. All right? But is evolution happening in other universes? Yes. Because across the cosmos, everything evolves all together. Now, some... Some uh, 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 planetary bodies and other universes have already gone supernova. All right? And when you talk about supernova, that's just another way of saying it has evolved 
into a much higher frequency, a much higher vibration, a much higher energy, a much higher uh, 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 um, level of power. All right. So it's important that you understand, brothers and sisters, that, you know, when we talk about these neutrinos and and they they and these Saxons saying, oh, no, our planet could never go supernova because they don't have doesn't have the proper amount of neutrinos. They're letting you know that at some point this baby going supernova and it's going to happen soon. And this is why so many brothers and sisters are awakening now because the energy, this energy is coming around us. This energy is awakening us because we was like, okay, this is a new day. This is a new dawn. This is a new hour. And we getting ready to go into a whole different level of energy. We going, we, we as the original beings in this lifetime, we're getting ready to go into a, 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 a level of power that we've never experienced in this lifetime. In past lives, we've experienced high levels of powers and frequencies and energies and vibrations and 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 uh, 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 different elemental forces and all in our past lives. But even in our past lives, coming into this life. This is something that we've never experienced because you got to remember energy moves forward. So, so many brothers and sisters saying, you know, oh yeah, we're getting ready to go back to where we were before. No, 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 no. We're not going back to where we were before because it doesn't work that way. Nature keeps going forward. You will remember where you were. You will remember where you were, but you won't go back to that place where you were. You can only go forward. You can only go forward with the energy, with the power, with the force, all right? Nature, frequencies, vibrations. You can only go forward. And when you talk about supernova, what are you talking about? You're talking about new frequencies, new vibrations, new energies, new um, uh, 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 forces, your thoughts. You know, the way you think, the, the way you do things. I mean, this all this all this plays a role, brothers and sisters. So, yes, our galactic sun is literally at a point of shifting. And when our galactic sun shifts, we shift. And this is that, the, you know, when they talk about the great flash, the great solar flash. You talk about the great solar flash. That's nothing but supernova. And when this happens, every being on this realm who's not indigenous to this realm or to this planet will be removed because the energy will be so great and powerful that their bodies will not be able to withstand it but we who are the original beings we who are the original we will literally flourish it will be like a warm spring day to us or to them It'll be chaos. It'll be chaos. I mean, this is why we say that this is a year of chaos and confusion because, you know, everything is evolving all around us, you know, and we are helping this evolution. Like, come Friday. There's a huge burst of energy getting ready to come Friday. Huge burst of energy that's literally going to cause part of this, these Saxon system. When we talk about this system, we talk about their monetary system. Because this is the main system that they run all the time. And it's literally, literally going to cause their monetary system to flatline for a, a short period of time. Huge burst of energy. And it's already in place right now. Even though they spray in the sky and they keep doing the things that they're doing. Because they share, they steadily call themselves trying to control the pressure and trying to control the energy. Their days of control is over. You know, you got so many brothers and sisters. You know, like my mom said, even though, even even the ones who are not awakened, saying their time is up. You know, my mom said it so so greatly. She says even the the brothers, even our people. She said even our people who are not awakened, they're saying that this is what she said. She said these white people time is up. So our people who are not even, who are in a sleep state, know that their time is up. And they're ready for them to go. So the whole key point is that we're getting ready to go to this powerful stage of shifting and changing. 
these neutrinos not only affect our planet, our galaxy, our sun, our moon, the neutrinos also affect us. These powerful radioactive particles that hold a massive amount of weight. These Saxons already said it, you know, like in, in the previous message, they say that they, they don't have the ability to measure it because this is power. They can't measure power. They don't know how to measure power. They don't know how to measure something that's that's extremely powerful as, you know, what you call the neutrinos. You know, the, sometime in this, in the, 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 the smallest particle have the biggest punch, carry the biggest pack. I mean, it's, it's, it, and that's the way it is. So yes, the supernova is coming. And we are getting ready to go into that stage, brothers and sisters. This is why we're doing the countdown. The days are coming where we would never need a calendar again. The days are coming where money will be uh, something in the distant past. It'll be just like it, when, when we shift, it'll be like money was something in the distant past. We would see all these old buildings as ruins and we would destroy them all and rebuild our realm, our planet, the way it's supposed to be built. This is what we would do. We told you what's getting ready to take place in the next 30 days. We told you what's getting ready to take place. As timekeepers, we have to let you guys know. We let the whole world know. Those who listen, they listen. Those who don't, they don't. But evolution is happening. The supernova energy is coming. And what do we say? We're going to be, we will, we will no longer be electromagnetic beings. We're going to be fully magnetic beings, but this is going to be a different type of magnetism. It's not like the, the, the magnets that we deal with now. This is going to be a plasma-based magnetic field, a plasma-based magnetic energy. And we're going to literally thrive on that. This is what we're going to be. You know, you got so many brothers and sisters in the sleep state and they don't, they don't, they have no idea who they are. But they will know as the energy progresses. We're not talking about time. We're talking about the energy. As the energy progresses, they will know. And this energy is 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 literally going to flow. This this energy is literally going to flow. It's 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 going to be on a completely different level. All right, as it is happening now, you know. Of course, you know, you got all of our people that still, you know, I'm not, I'm not even worried about it, brothers and sisters, because, you know, as this energy rises, going to have our people that's going to be in, the, in this awakened state and they're going to wake up. They're going to wake up and they're going to, they're going to feel the energy. They're going to feel the power. And they will have no other choice but to be in this awakening. They will have no other choice but to wake up. It's like a, it's, it's like it's going to be a shaking, and this is part of that supernova. It's like that old. It's it's, it's like a a, a snake uh, a, a shedding his skin, and you're going to shed off that old person, the old things, the old things that you did before, and you're going to forget all about it. And you're going to be in a new mindset, and a new type of energy, a new type of power, and this is where it's growing. You know. We're going to still do the things that we did. You know, of course, yeah, we're still going to have sex. We're still going to do all these different things. Yeah, we are. You know, we're still going to have fun. We, you know, but we're going to be in a completely different state of mind. And we're going to be much more powerful warriors. We're going to be more attentive. We're going to be more uh, 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 um, awakened to um, everything going around us. We're going to be more aware. And we're going to remember everything in our past. Like we say, it's, it, it might seem like it'll be in the distant past, but we're going to remember it. All right? So this is this is all about the supernova state. Everything is changing. Nibiru is playing a major role in this. All right? Nibiru is playing a major role in this uh, uh, thing, uh, this, this, this uh, awakening energy. All right. Nibiru is definitely playing a major role. All right. So just know all these energies and, and all these frequencies and these vibrations and, and everything that's happening. It's not happening 
just out of for nothing. This is happening because everything in the cosmos, every planet, every every galaxy, every universe, every star system, every uh, uh, living organism that is indigenous evolves. And this is why these Saxons want to keep us trying to try to keep us in this this lower mindset because they're scared of evolution. Because evolution means that they're wiped out. That's all right. It doesn't matter. We're nature. No matter whether you're asleep or awake, you're going to wake up anyway, one way or the other. All right? I'll catch you guys later. You know the deal. All power to the multi chakra celestial angelic beings. May chaos reign with you forever and ever and ever. And remember, chaos is change. Chaos is change, brothers and sisters. Just know that. Chaos is change. And this change. It's definitely taking us into a higher frequency, a higher vibration, a higher energy, and a higher power. All right? Catch you guys later. Much power to you all.